Developing tonight, a grandmother in Hardin County wants justice for her six year old grandson. He ended up in the hospital after reportedly being attacked by their neighbors, neighbors, three pit bulls on Cooks Lake Road. Good evening, Southeast Texas. I'm Kyle or Cladra has the night off. While the boy Elijah Johnson is, is expected to make a full recovery, the family says the owners of the dogs should be held liable. I spoke with his grandmother who wants justice. They just ran up on me and jumped on me. A normal summer day for six year old Elijah Johnson turned into a terrifying encounter Tuesday evening. He's recovering from several bites from what the family says were three large pit bulls belonging to their next door neighbors. He was bitten on his arm. I think the dog bit through his hand and on his leg and his uh, behind. Elijah said his uncle's bravery stopped the attack from getting worse. My uncle pooped it. Safety. He chased them with a gray bucket. Elijah was rushed to Baptist Hospital. He's expected to make a full recovery, but he has to endure weeks of tetanus and rabies shots. His grandmother, Tracy Bratford, says the dog's owners must hold themselves accountable. I think that the owners um, should take the responsibility to pay his, his hospital bills. Hardin County Sheriff Mark Davis commented on the attack, saying, quote, the owners of the dogs have been located and are cooperating with the investigation. Two dogs were killed by the owner. Two dogs have been isolated for observation. Sheriff Davis says the county does not have an ordinance involving dogs, and the investigation regarding any charges is ongoing. The family hopes the neighbors will take measures to contain their animals before someone else gets hurt. I also would like to see the owners provide fencing or whatever they need to keep, you know, this situation from happening again. I'm not angry with anybody. I just want something done. 